What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode. I'm your host, T. I'm Tasha. And welcome to the Adventures of TNT. Now, this is episode two of our Tom McDonald reaction journey, in which the first video that we did was Dear Rappers. How did you feel about that? I was, like, caught off guard. Really? Why? Because I wasn't expecting him to say what he said. Okay, yeah. He just came in snatching wigs, eyebrows, everything. Yeah, he, yeah. He, he came with the truth and didn't hold anything back. Right. So he, it was refreshing to hear, actually. Hmm. Now, he was definitely delivering on the messages. And it, it was very interesting because before we actually heard the song... Uh, um, or did the reaction, we gave our thoughts and our feelings on the state of hip hop mm. and where it was and what we yeah. liked and what we didn't like. And it was so interesting to hear that video or hear the song and see that it was directly in line with the things that we didn't like about uh, the hip hop industry. So um, the next song we're going to be checking out is Hell of It. Not sure what to expect. I know what to expect. Oh, what do you... What, Some what do you facts doing? on facts on facts. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, cool. All right, well, let's go ahead and jump into it, and uh, let's let's check it out see what it's all about. Hell of it. Hell of it. You ready, baby? Mm-hmm. All right, let's go. It's born ready. Hey. They try to tell me I should dumb it down Say you're too conscious for the fans to feel you Try to tell me I should calm it down If you fight the system, they gon' try to kill you They try to tell me that I'm too sad And it isn't healthy, I knew that I'm just doing me and if you don't agree And I don't owe you then that is too bad I fired shots at all the mumble rappers And they try to say I'm not a humble rapper So I tell them I'm not like these other rappers And they try to say I'm just another rapper I guess there's no pleasing, y'all If the record has meaning, you don't leave it on But you stream all the songs that repeat the same shit about Xanax and liquor and drugs I could have a seizure like Wayne I could just go OD like Peep I could just go crazy like Ye I could just get locked up like Meek Repeat the Boy, it's dropping too much for you <laughs> Alright, first of all, first of all, first of all <laughs> First of all, let's talk about this beat Woo! The beat is Fire. chill Fire! Yeah That beat, the beat is, is just chill. like And... I think with a lot of rappers nowadays, you have a fire beat with a whole bunch of nothing. A whole bunch of nothing. You don't know what they're saying, and so basically, people are selling beats. Yeah, they're enjoying. And if the beat right. is just hot, right. then you can sell. Right. It's refreshing to hear someone say something with meaning, where. Yeah, you're grooving to the music. Yeah, yeah. But you're yeah. picking up actual yes. lyrics. Yes, yes. You're hearing it clearly. And the way he's flowing and the way he's riding the beat, <laughs> you can just... You, he's skiing on the beat, y'all. Oh, yeah, yeah. He is skiing on skiing the beat. Skiing on the beat. <laughs> and, and, you know, and that's what makes it so good. The fact that you can vibe out to the, the to the beat, mm -hmm. and then you can pick up the lyrics because mm -hmm. he's not mumbling his words; he's saying it very clear, concise, mm -hmm. and it's it's just makes a lot of sense. Yeah. So I need you to take it back. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead. Every time we pause it, guys, we're gonna go ahead and take it back. Now we're not we we usually don't pause our videos, but uh, but we will for you guys. I know some of y'all have requested to pause it if we have something to say. So let's take it back just a little bit. I could have a seizure like Wayne. I could just go OD like Peep. I could just go crazy like Ye. I could just get locked up like Meek. Repeat the same thing, using stupid slang, yelling Gucci gang on every claim like beat. Or I could be me. At least I can breathe. At least I can sleep, knowing that I never sold myself for money or a dream. These rappers all coked out. They just mumble lots. They got broke mouths. They got ten chains and got no house. They got twenty <laughs> and got no spouse. Smart rappers don't drink lean. That's kid. We ain't sixteen. Got a problem? I welcome it. I'm doing me. This is too much. This Woo! is too much, y'all. This is too much. Woo! This is too much. He's just dropping too much stuff. Woo! Oh, man. You're giving me heart palpitations. All right. And mind you guys, this is like our first time jumping into this guy's music. So we were expecting this. Woo! All right. Let's 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 get... Are you ready, babe? Oh. Woo. All right. Let's go. Strap this, in, y'all. Right. Got to click the seat belt on. Okay. We ain't 16. If you got a problem, I welcome it. I'll be doing me for the hell of it. Tell you, I'm loving this beat. For the hell of it. They said 
to go to hell So I packed my shit and went with it Little did they know that they put me in my element hey. I'm fired to the bone Now diamonds in my skeleton I'm finally in my zone Doing me for the hell of it Try to tell me to ignore the haters You gon' get revenge when you're successful later They try to tell me I should not respond And I should write a song and put it all on paper They try to tell me I'm the bigger man If I'm not underhanded when I write them back And I try to tell them it's impossible Thousands of people a day have been saying I'm hey. whack I try to tell them that it's complicated I could write a novel about getting faded But the conscious fans are gonna hate it And the wavy kids are gonna love to play it So I write a song that's got a message in it And the wavy kids are saying it's pathetic But the conscious fans think it's awesome man They comment like man I really get it So what the do y'all want I right. could have a seizure like Wayne I could just go OD like Peep I could just go crazy like Ye I could just get locked up like Meek I could just go sell out like Jay I could just stay real like Wally. I could just get money like Drake Or I could just say that I'm done playing games And get famous and know that I always stay me So go ahead and bump the mumble rap Don't boycott it, just understand If you eat at McDonald's, you're gonna get fat If you listen to garbage, your head fills with trash Get oh. in the club and spend all of your money Cause rappers have told you it makes you somebody Then comment on this with your jelly for the hell of it. Come on, bro. Hey. <laughs> Come on, man. For the hell of it. They said to go to hell, so I packed my and went with it. Little did they know that they put me in my element. I'm fired to the bone now. Diamonds in my skeleton. I'm finally in my zone doing me for the hell of it. I got literal chills. My temperature has risen. Is this is crazy? This is crazy. I feel like I need to hear it again. Yeah. This is how amazing this track is. This is how amazing an artist he is, and he's dropping names. Yeah. And this song. He said, I could just get locked up like Meek. I could go crazy like Ye. I could sell out like Jay. I'm just like, Whoo. facts on facts, on facts, on facts. Right. Yeah. And no one really can contest this. Like, no matter how angry you are about this, him being a right white rapper, uh, the truth is the truth is the truth. Okay, and if you go against this, because we had a couple people come in our comment section angry, um, but aren't able to explain why. Okay, if you don't like something, you feel that uh, it's not the truth, then go ahead and lay the facts down. But Everything he says in this is the truth. So only the only thing that many can do is just be mad. Right. There's no logic behind the madness, right. okay? And the beat, the lyrics, he has shown himself to be a lyricist that just cannot be touched, okay? He... Oh, I, it's just so much to say. I, I want to give you a chance to talk okay. because, yeah. um, like as I stated, my with my initial reaction, I really love, I love the beat. I love how he wrote the beat. Um, I love how clear his message is, how clear his words are when he's, you know, saying whatever mm -hmm. he's saying. But um, overall, I just really enjoyed the song. Mm -hmm. I really enjoyed the fact that he he's talking about his frustration with the fans, frustration with the industry. Uh, you're saying I'm too conscious. You're saying I'm too this and too that. Well, you know what, F it, I'm just gonna do me. Uh, and uh, it's, it's like, you know, he, I'm, he he's basically saying I'm gonna do me and whoever wants to follow is gonna follow me. I mean, this just lit like a fire in yeah. me. Like it just- It spoke to you. It spoke to me when he was like, Y'all don't have spouses and y'all drinking lean, but that's for 16-year-olds. Yeah. And let's talk about wealth and 
you got 10 chains but don't own a house. Yeah. Like, I know I'm not reciting this verbatim. <laughs> well, he was, you know, my, fa I my mean, favorite verse in it. And maybe we need to do a lyrical breakdown. Whoop, Guys, whoop. let us know in the comment section because <laughs> we we do, like I said, we do like a lot of rock and, and country and metal on this channel, but we do lyrical breakdowns to, mm -hmm. to those songs. And so it'll be very interesting to do a lyrical breakdown of Tom's uh, songs and break down these lyrics. But the verse that I really enjoyed, and maybe we'll make this a thing, we'll go over a verse that we enjoyed. The verse I enjoyed the most mm -hmm. was when he was saying, if you eat McDonald's, you're you're gonna, get, you're gonna fat. get fat. And if you're listening to mumble rap, you know your brain is gonna turn into trash or something like that. <laughs> it's like, what do you expect? And so, um, just gems on top of gems on top of gems. And uh, I know after listening to this song, I'm thoroughly gonna enjoy this journey. Woo. So guys, uh, Wait. Uh, oh, go ahead, baby. So like I've said in uh, the past, I think two videos. This is facts and poetry. Yeah. He has a way of putting together words that just flow so eloquently. And I haven't seen this done in years. For those of you who know, I love A Tribe Called Quest. The lyricism that they have that's intertwined with jazz and um, blues and stuff like that. Uh, they were able to eloquently um, recite their lyrics like poetry. And I'm not comparing the two because Tom McDonald is his own artist, but the only way that I can put it is, is facts and poetry. Yeah. It's just... Yeah. His delivery is very his poetic. His delivery it's very is poetic. just... Yeah. Chef's kiss. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, um, yeah. So, guys, leave your thoughts down below. We are going to go ahead and continue our Tom McDonald journey. So, make Ooh. sure you stay tuned for episode three. Leave uh, your request on the next song. For because, the next song. Yes, for the next song. Because, of course, we don't know where to go next. Uh, so, we're just kind of taking your request and going with the next song. So, a lot of you have requested Hell of It. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to do Castles next or another song. So leave those requests down below in the bottom uh, in the comment section. And we'll see y'all next and time. Wait. And for the haters, just go ahead and go somewhere else. This, we don't have any room for that. Yeah, we don't have any energy <laughs> for it. I mean, we're on a journey right now. And this is just so needed right now. So uh, I want to thank everyone. Uh, the Hog family for really supporting us and just creating this whole new family Absolutely. on the channel. Like my cousin <laughs> even texted me before he even knew we did a reaction. Yeah. He was like, hey, have you heard of Tom McDonald? Right. And I just, that just shows to me how amazing Tom is because oh, yeah. he's just crossing so many boundaries and you know even color lines you know and so many of us are just tired of the craziness that is going on absolutely and we're all like really yearning for truth right you know so uh leave your thoughts in the comment section below um and if you're a hater that just delete yourself and go somewhere else and make sure you smash that like button smash that subscribe button and share this please share this because this needs to be heard, okay? And, um, yeah, we'll see you in our next video. All right. In the meantime, we're going to go ahead and listen to this again. Oh. <laughs> so we'll see hey. you guys later. <laughs>